low-paid jobs and have no money to get back home, so the only thing left for them is to take to the streets and steal. Paint and professor Sergei Zagrayevsky was walking home late one night via this boulevard in the center of Moscow when a group of men attacked him and demanded money. He had sold a painting that day and had some $1,500 in his pocket. I bent over to tie my shoestrings, and they came up and started hitting me. While I was lying on the ground, I could hear them speaking Russian with a strong accent. The attackers didn't have a clue that Sergei was also good at martial arts. He says they all ran off as soon as he managed to get to his feet. The painter was attacked in this boulevard twice. First time, some four years ago, by skinheads, who he thinks did it because he's Jewish. This time, Sergei says he feels sorry for the attackers. They were obviously just guest workers, probably fired from their construction jobs. I didn't even call the police. He says he's lucky to be physically strong, but if a weak man had been in his place, he could...